Welcome back everyone. You may be in a situation where for some reason phone numbers are not showing up either with an iMessage or FaceTime. Now this can happen for a few different reasons. Essentially, if you have a contact that was assigned with an email and then you put in a phone number afterwards or something like that, that may be what's going on. But the first thing you want to do here is you want to go and click on your settings icon like this. And all you want to do is you want to scroll down until you see this little iMessage icon. So you'll see messages in FaceTime. Let's go and try messages first. Let's go and make our way over to iMessage. And all you want to do here is you want to disable this iMessage toggle and you want to go ahead and turn it back on. I will definitely tell you for a majority of different things you're going to be doing, disabling and re-enabling whichever option you, you know, specific app that's causing this issue is pretty much going to fix it for you. So what you want to do here is you want to turn off iMessage, toggle that off, and then you want to toggle it back on. And I will definitely tell you for a majority of the things you're going to do, that's probably going to end up fixing it for you. Now let's say you do that and that doesn't end up fixing it. Well, the next thing you may have to do is scroll down into FaceTime. So let's go and click on FaceTime right here. And right here where it says FaceTime, we want to go ahead and disable this option as well. Now, like I mentioned, this will probably end up fixing it for you by disabling FaceTime and turning it back on. It'll resync everything. And that's pretty much the main thing you can do in this example. Now, let's say you do that and that still doesn't work. Well, the next thing I'd recommend doing is going back into your settings icon in your application like this. You want to go and click on general, which is right here. And then you want to go and click on software update, which is right there. And all you want to do here is you want to go ahead and just update your phone to the most recent version of software that's available. Most of the time, if you're having some sort of like software issue like this out of the blue, well, this is probably what you're going to have to do. And this may end up fixing it for you as well. I think that whole entire thing rhymed. Now, ultimately, if that still doesn't work, and if it's only for a few contacts, you can go back into your phone, you can go into your contacts and kind of re-edit a lot of these contacts, remove the email, put in the phone number, vice versa. And that may end up fixing it for you as well. So that kind of covers it up for the most part. If you have any other questions or anything, let me know in the comment section as well. Hit the like button, that would be so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video.